Hi everyone, we are going to do a lesson today on polygons, les polygones, and it's a lot easier than it sounds. If I look at these shapes here, these are polygons. These ones down here are not polygons. So when I look at the two different groups, I can see that these ones are polygons. They all have straight sides. They all have straight edges. Down here, the circle is not a straight edge. This one is wavy. This one is curved. The other thing that is true about a polygon is that it's all closed in. If I look down here, this shape is not closed. It just kind of ends here. Or this one, it's not enclosed. So a polygon is a shape that has straight edges and it's enclosed. Popular or uh, polygons that we talk about a lot are these ones. If it has three sides, it is a triangle, a triangle. Four sides is a quadrilateral, a quadrilateral. Five sides is called a pentagon or a pentagon. Six sides is a hexagon or a hexagon. And then eight sides is an octagon or an octagon. It doesn't mention the seven-sided polygon. It's called a heptagon or an heptagon in French, but uh, strangely enough, it never mentions it in our book. So three sides is a triangle, quatre côtés, a quadrilatère, cinq côtés, it's a pentagon, six côtés, it's an hexagon, a huit côtés, it's an octagon. So this is something that you really have to read over a few times, practice a few times. It's something that you kind of have to study to remember them. Triangle, we already know. And maybe pentagon and hexagon, maybe even octagon, you already know. Uh, quadrilatère isn't a word that we have used yet. So if I look at this grouping, they have a rule to sort these shapes. So if you just look at that, you wonder what rule they used. So if you count the sides, I can tell they're polygons because they have straight edges and they're enclosed. So if I look at them, this group over here all has three sides. So they're all triangles, the triangle. And this group, if I count, un, deux, trois, quatre, cinq, un, deux, trois, quatre, cinq, un, deux, trois, quatre, cinq, un, deux, trois, quatre, cinq. They all have five sides, so they are all pentagons, the pentagon. Down here, it's grouped a little differently. If I look at this side, and I count them all, they all have four sides. So they're a quadrilatère. And over here, they don't all have the same side, uh, sorry, the same number of sides. So I could say, these have four sides. These all have more than four sides. So that was their rule for grouping those. So I'd like you to press pause on this video and to look at these shapes here. I know they're polygons because they have straight edges and they're all enclosed. And I want you to figure out if you can find any that would fit into these groups. So a pentagon, and we know that a pentagon has five sides. An octagon has eight sides. A hexagon has six sides. Are they looking six? A quadrilatère has four sides. And a triangle, we know that one, it has three sides. So if I look at the first one, it has a, de, so I can even mark them if I want to, or you can point to them on your computer or laptop. Un, deux, trois, quatre, cinq, six. It has six sides, so it is a hexagon. A 
hexagon. So I'd like you to press pause now, and I'd like you to count the sides of each polygon and see if you can figure out which one it would fit into. Okay, so just a little review. Three-sided polygons are triangles, they triangle. You can see examples of them here. If they have four sides, it's a quadrilatère. And here are different examples. Those are not the only examples of quadrilatère. Any shape that has straight edges, it's enclosed and has four sides, is a quadrilateral, a quadrilatère. A pentagon has five sides. This is what we call a regular pentagon. That's, that means it's one that we see often. This is an irregular one. We don't see as often, but it's still a pentagon. A hexagon has six sides, and an octagon has eight sides, an octagon. So what I would like you to do now, you can go back in this video and look at the different examples. I would like you to have a piece of paper, and you all have paper at home now, and I would like you to draw me. All you need is a straight edge. It doesn't have to be a ruler. Most of you have a ruler at home now, but just the straight edge of a book or use any kind of straight edge. I'd like you to draw me a triangle. So just any polygon with three sides, a quadrilatère, a pentagon, a hexagon, and octagon. So one, two, three, four, five. I'd like you to draw me five different shapes, ask someone to take a picture of it, and send it to me. Have a great day.